Welcome back everyone to Mercury Fallen with me, Vapor. Okay, so there was a little bit of interest in this game, so I thought I would carry on. Obviously, like I said in the last episode, this is probably only going to be two to three episodes long because it's not huge amounts of content, but I thought I should continue anyway and go for the, like, the couple of things that I've not covered. Um, somebody asked if I could destroy this glowing square in the middle of the, um, the, middle of the base. I just wanted to point out that this is an elevator. Um, if I can get out of that tool, um, which allows you to go to the surface. Unfortunately, at the moment, that part of the game isn't kind of functional. However, it is a storage space as well. So, if these two ever get full, or one of them is full, about the one next to it, if I can click on it, well, they're both full. Interesting. So, this one should start to get used, I would have thought. We're probably going to need some storage for food, but I don't think. Can we not? say what we want in here I don't think we can no they just literally drop whatever they find in there so let's let's put a refrigerator in our kitchen which we've not built yet so we'll put a couple of those in there and we will need the cooking station which I will venture a guess needs power so one of the next things that we're going to need to do is um kind of expand our power generation yeah, it does need power and ironically the fridges don't <laughs> it's a little bit strange I would say they they should require power realistically speaking because they don't work without it okay so what did we need for this an iron ingot copper ingot so we need to get this done so let's do five of those how many does it need 10 iron 10 copper okay so let's do 10 of those. Now, the question is, who is going to work on that? Oh, that is a good question. What are you? Are you a engineer, maybe? Well, you're everything. Okay. Are you just hauling at the moment? Yep, you are kind of hauling. And you are doing probably the bioplastic or whatever it was called. Is it called that? Structure resin, there we go. Thinking of a different game. So it's probably best if we just grab one of these random people and set them um, to work on the refinery. Let's have a look. So we don't want the hauling. So we've got miner and builder. Okay, let's take those out. I will assume. Hmm. It's got to be an engineer, right? Out of all the different things we've got in there. I've got to assume that's it. But the problem is they're probably going to work this before they work this. So if we switch that off and that one. Because I think we've got quite a bit of resources uh, with regards to that. Um, let's have a look. What's this? Oh, we have some iron ingots. Some copper ingots. So why have they not made this? That's interesting. We actually have a, a ton of resources. <laughs> I don't think we need to make any more. In fact, if I'd have set them to... That's a way of turning that off. Yes, Q empty, Q empty. We don't actually. That's really bizarre. Why have they not started work on that? Are they going to do it now? No. Nope. Where are you off with those resources? Let's, let's drop another let's drop another one and see what happens let's put it to one side slightly just in case they can't access it for whatever reason it seems we have the resources so they should be able to do it they need iron ingots too okay interesting I wonder if that's a bug and this, this chap's kind of bouncing around on the spot. Okay, you're engineers. Let's put building in your vocation as well. What else? Oh, actually, I wonder if storage is a problem. Hmm. Okay, I just had a blowtorch. So they're going to be building something, I guess. Um, what about looking for storage? Let's whack a couple of these in here. Aha! Uh -huh. uh, you're probably going to build the conduits, aren't you? I will assume that's what you're doing. Let's have a look. Yes. Interesting that they're not doing those. 
Okay, so let's switch. You build or a miner, so you're naturally going to do that first. Wow, I've actually, <laughs> I've actually cleared up quite a lot of stuff. Right, let's stop them mining for a while. Whoops, we didn't want to do that. I completely... There we go, that's all I wanted to do. So we've got some more water down. I thought that was copper for a second. Let's just clear this out. Right, so that should stop them from doing that. This person just literally wants to run into the corner for whatever strange reason. Okay, so they've built the storage. Why are they not building the power? Hmm. Let's try building something else. Let's try building some beds. Let's see what happens here, because this just needs the basic resource, if I remember rightly. And let's put some lamps in here as well. A nice bedside lamp. They look like they're glitching out a little bit, I've got to be honest. Power generator, what else have we got? Science floor, okay, we don't need any of that. Oh, dining room. We completely forgot about that. Okay, so let's, let's leave a double space for a corridor, I think. And we'll have the entrance here. I don't know how big this room needs to be. I guess it really depends on how many people we're going to actually have. And we haven't grown any new people yet. I'm not even sure if it's possible to do that yet. It's something that we should possibly have a look at. So we need the... Assume, is it going to be recreational? Yes, recreational floor. Which is this one plop that in there and we will put some hallway in here as well if you can do it properly okay it doesn't seem to it's been a bit strange oh there we go it's not wanting to play ball so to speak okay so they built the beds there seems to be anything that requires ingots can we have we got steel that's a question steel ingots Let's do five of those. Let's see what happens. I don't think we have. What have we got here? Copper, bioplastic, iron. Okay, so what do we need for the steel ones? Steel ingots. Okay, so they've made something there. Um, okay, we should, by rights, be able to do that. I th think they're doing it. Let's see. This strange glitching doesn't help. It's really hard to see what they're doing. Well, there's eight, eight sat there, but I didn't ask them to do this. Um, how do we? How do we stop them? Right. Steel. Five. <laughs> is that going to work? Switch back to iron. Is this going to say steel? Look, it is. Okay. They're just literally obsessed with this area now. It's a little bit random. I don't quite... I really don't get how they prioritise what they've got to do. Okay, you've gone to sleep. Well, don't blame you. It's, <laughs> it's, it's stressful. It really is stressful. It's the only like, downside to, to early alpha games. That everything works properly. And, and then there's kind of my understanding of how it works as well. So you've not worked on that either. Hmm. I'm guessing these guys, yeah, are just hauling stuff as it stands. The game clearly doesn't like the high speed. It does make people a little bit jittery. When you slow it down, it doesn't seem to happen. <laughs> it is kind of funny. In a way, let's put this in here if we can. Okay, we can't do it yet. That's fine. I think these need power as well. Did they build... Oh, they didn't even build the, all the power cable. I don't know if they're getting a little bit confused over what they should be doing. I suppose that is a possibility. I don't think it's a lack of... Re oh, somebody's working here. Excellent. So you're making some of the steel. Did this require steel? No. So it still doesn't explain why they're not building those. 
Okay, you got one left. Right, that's everything. So it, it makes a noise when it's finished. At least we know that. So that needs iron. That needs steel. That needs eight steel. So let's build... Let's do 15, because we need a couple more for the other fridge. Let's see if they manage to construct that. That would be interesting to see. I feel like I'm missing something. Hey, storage. Okay, so there's nothing else up here. Ah. So this is what we've got in our inventory. Okay, so we have no potatoes. So that means we have no food, right? That's a little bit concerning. Bioplastic. Structure resin. Hmm. Yeah, we've got a lot of bioplastic. What needs that? There's nothing that I can see at this stage. Okay. Hmm. So what's happened to all these potatoes, I wonder? If we don't currently have any. Are they just lingering around everywhere? bit confuzzled because we clearly have them. Um, okay, there's no more research to do, so that's that. That's the game menu. Definitely have potatoes. Okay. So engineering is... Oh, that'll be the steel finish. So that's that. Hallway we know. Kitchen we know. Utilities here. Science we've got. Okay, so we've used all the different types of floors. Some of these are locked. Wait a minute. Research required utilities. Hmm. Oh. Okay, we didn't do that. Okay, let's let's just go for that then. As soon as we've not done it, that's the like the final piece of the puzzle. But I think that was water. That doesn't seem to make a difference. That needs to be in the science lab. Okay, should we? Wow, that's big. We're gonna need to make a bigger science lab. Does it even work? I wonder station, computer station, crop field. I think to build the bioplastic we need flax. So there, there is that as well. It still doesn't explain why these are not being done. And there's no way of prioritising, which is frustrating me a little bit, I've got to admit. Okay, so I've had a look around. I'm pretty sure we've lost someone. I could have swore we had four people, but... <laughs> I literally can't see the fourth person anywhere. And for some strange reason, they've now decided... Yeah, let's let's build the cooker. That's fine. And the fridges. And once the fridges came in, they started to register food. So, that is kind of fantastic. The only weird kind of thing is... That was the only place in this room it would allow me to put a table. And I get he wouldn't let me put it, put it straight against the wall, that's fine, but you would think here, right? So that's probably not working properly yet. So let's have a look at this. So we've got simple meals, that's all we can do. So let's, um, let's do 20. I don't know kind of how much these guys actually need to eat, if anything at all at this stage. Who can we pinch? Let's make you a cook and a botanist. So you can take care of the uh, potatoes and the food. These have still not built. I wonder if it's because we've not got bioplastic. How much do they need? Not a lot. I think that could be what the problem is. So let's kind of try and fix that now. Um, we're going to extend our garden a little bit. Let's come down here and put a door in here. In fact, is that wide enough? Let's have a look. Oh, it is. I was going to actually... Oh, we can... oh, it's got to be on dirt, hasn't it? Hmm. Actually, we'll, we'll leave it that way. I don't know how much we need. But what we'll do is we'll put three of these in. Then... We can use this area. Oh, fridges is what they need, isn't it? Say for storage. I don't know if hemp needs to go into refrigeration, to be honest with you. But let's put one of those in. And if we put... Or do we really want to put a fridge there? Although it's almost... One of them's almost full. Let's 
if it will allow us, which it might not. Is the fridge? No, it can only be placed in the kitchen. I'm guessing. Oh. Kind of glitching there. You can see it wants to allow me to do it. I could actually technically switch some of those to hemp if if we really needed it. It only takes two potatoes to make a meal. So this fridge has got quite a lot of them. Okay, so you're going to do hemp. And if we speed the game up, I've noticed if you run it on full speed sometimes, when they glitch like this, they don't actually do what they're supposed to do. So just watch what happens. Now, if I drop the speed down, they do the job. So obviously that, that's a bug at this stage. You're not trapped around there, are you? No, you can come back. That's fine. Which, when you want to run the game a little bit quicker, is a touch annoying. Okay, so we have a table anyway. We have rooms with the really bright lights. We have the kitchen. The power, not yet. But I would guess, like I said earlier, that's probably something to do with. In fact, we need some structure resin, don't we? Yep. Let's do... Actually, we probably don't, in all fairness. Let me double check that. Oh, yes, we do. I was just thinking because why have they stopped it? So it must be down to that. We use quite a lot. Let's do 50 of that. Pyroplastics. Yes. So we're just waiting for the hemp, which is currently growing. He looks trapped. So let's just mine a line along there. This is, this is kind of weird glitches. Although I really, really like kind of the direction the game's going. It looks like there's going to be trade as well. So if you look here, incoming resources to the facility from expeditions and trade. Hence this. So it'd be really interesting to see what else they actually add over time. Or say, he adds. I think it's one person. Well, we seem to have come across a little bit of a problem. This person will not move away from this area. He's saying not connected, not enough power. <laughs> We're only really using the power for these, so... I'm a little bit confused as to what the problem is. I want this to do with these things. Let's take them away. Nope. <laughs> um, I've also tried to put in the water pump, because I realise you can't cook meals without a water pump, but that's not working either. Let's take that away. Let's... Cancel some of these things. Still saying not enough power, not connected. It's definitely connected. There couldn't be any more power cables going underneath this piece of equipment if I tried. A little bit strange. So I don't know if, if my save file is just bugged because there has been a patch or whether um, it's just not working. It, the problem seemed to occur as soon as I tried to do bioplastic. And I have the hemp, which is here, but it's just not happening. And I've tried rebuilding and deconstructing and things like that. So it's, in a sense, it's not allowing me to go any further. So, ah, I don't know, like I said, I'm not sure if it's a bug or not. Because obviously there's the bug where they, they jitter out a little bit when you go on high speed. But, yeah, it's a little bit unfortunate because I was looking forward to seeing if I could actually grow somebody yet. So I think what I'm going to do is... We'll definitely only be doing two episodes unless there is a patch in the next day or two. Uh, but I'll keep this playlist open, so uh, follow it by all means or drop me a subscribe, whatever. Um, and as soon as there is patches, and if it's only a little patch, I won't do anything. But as soon as there's like some sizable content, the way the guy is pushing stuff out at the moment, I think probably in a couple of weeks there'll probably be a few new bits um, to play with. So I will definitely continue because I want to see where this game goes. I'm quite interested in how it works. Um, it seems quite interesting. It needs a little bit of more story, should I say, because we get that we're, we've come here and, and things have gone wrong and we had to repair them, but it'd be, be interesting to see what else. I think somebody suggested in the comments, will there be things to kill? I wouldn't mind some invaders. I think that'd be, that'd be quite interesting. But anyway, on that note, thank you very much for watching. But until next time, as always, take care.
canción para mi gente. 